Every visitor can have an immersive experience here at this digital exhibition. Take a photo of yourself, and you can try on this beautiful Qing Dynasty costume by the LED screen. By clicking some buttons on your smartphone, you can keep the picture and share it with your friends if you like. Or you can have an animated version of this bird and flower painting by scanning the still picture on the screen. With the help of this VR helmet, you can enter this room, decorated in ancient style, through the virtual world and play Tohu, a game popular in the Tang Dynasty. The palace museum has worked intensively to promote traditional Chinese culture through modern technologies in recent years. It hopes in this way to keep with the times and attract a younger generation of visitors. The Palace Museum is currently promoting a diverse open museum experience for visitors through modern technology. This exhibition is one of our explorations. I believe we can promote traditional culture in a creative way and foster the young generation's passion for traditional culture. In 2015, the Palace Museum and Tencent organized a design competition. The aim was to get young Chinese designers geared up to develop emojis, games, and other culturally creative items inspired by elements within the Forbidden City. Some of the winning items are presented at this show. The exhibition also displays recent achievements made by domestic and overseas institutions such as Google Arts and Culture and Japan-based digital art group Team Lab. Our team members are all architects. We are passionate about traditional Chinese buildings and new technology. Since the Palace Museum is the best representative, we created this 3D printed model of the Forbidden City. The exhibition was featured at the Culture Plus Tech International Forum, presented by the Palace Museum and Tencent. The two also have launched a joint innovation lab. They will explore creative ways to protect, promote, and revitalize traditional Chinese culture by applying new technologies. With Tencent's Internet resources and new technology, plus the Palace Museum's rich cultural resources, I believe we can do much more in the future to make Chinese culture more accessible to the world. The digital exhibition called Traditional Culture and Future Imagination runs through December the 8th.